you have to understand how to keep your mind calm and understand that this is part of the game. All this is part of the game. So you have to first keep your mental mind locked in on what you're doing. You never stop preparing to get ready for your upcoming season. Regardless if you've gotten that call or they're telling you that they, somebody said yes and no and whatever. The, your job is to stay ready, stay preparing for when that time calls. When that time comes, you need to be ready. I was speaking with someone, uh, I don't want to drop no names. I was speaking with someone, they were talking about someone else. And they were saying that this guy, he was just, you know, his agent ain't hit him up. And he's supposed to be, he's supposed to be finding him a job. And he's not responding. And he was supposed to do, um, find him something by now. And it's just not following through. And he's not giving them any good opportunities. And then he's still hurt. He's hurt right now. And... You just got so many other different situations going on. And you just got that mental stress on. I'm not even signed yet. I'm not even signed yet. You hurt. You're aging on BS. And you ain't got no contract. You're going to be feeling some type of way. You're going to be feeling some type of way. But you got to understand. You got to navigate and manage it. Manage and control only what you can control. One, if you hurt already. Go get some therapy. Get yourself right. Don't try to rush to get to somewhere not fully there. Last thing you want to do is go to a team in a situation and not be fully healthy or at least 80 to 85 percent healthy and you can get yourself right during before the season starts. Then to go in hurt, trying to make something happen and get even more hurt and then be done for. You never want to get cut because you've been hurt or you came in hurt because they're going to bro. You never want to come in being hurt. If you come in being hurt, oh my goodness, bro. It's like they will try to demolish your name for that. Don't tr don't come in hurt. That's the last thing you want to do. Do not come in hurt. Get your body right first. All these times right now, it's time to just prepare your body and get them, hit them weights, stretching calisthenics. More so than get your skills workout in, but your body, you need to be just tuning that body because you just got to be ready for the longevity of it all. The long season, the workouts, all this stuff. You just want to get your mind and your body on the same synchronization. Get yourself into a routine and start getting in now. Okay, I'm waking up, training, this, this, that, and the third to get prepared for the upcoming season. Even if there is nothing on the table right now, you still have to get your mind ready for this time. That's part of of the waiting game that's just part of the game you're just going to run into times where it's just going to be you're stuck and you should be and you people are passing by and then you're going to start seeing your homeboys playing or they're playing right now in the season and they're going crazy already and the season's starting for them and you're like man my agent ain't got nothing from you and then you looking around your oh parents especially for you young guys for the younger um hoopers you got parents looking at you like hey what's going on man What's going on? You're supposed to be playing. You this and you know they're hiring over here. I was about 24. I was about 24. I went to Mexico. I got cut. I spent. I took all the little money that they gave me. It was there for two weeks. I got cut. I went to DR. Used all the money from Mexico that I got. Borrowed some money. Went to DR on a tour. Scam. Didn't have the money. Came back home. My mom's looking at me like, hey. You know they have them. It's waitress season right now. You can go get you some good tips. Good tips. Parents start looking at you like, "Hey, you tried. You tried. Now it's time to get back to the real world. You did your little overseas things or whatever. Now it's time to start like really paying attention. What's going on? People start looking at you like, "Dang, so what you doing, bro? You're not working. You're not doing that because." You're doing, it. you're doing something completely different than the average person is doing it. So it's kind of hard for them to understand that you're not getting up going to work. Like, bro, are you working or what are you doing? Especially your family members, your parents, there are people close to you start looking at you like, bro, what you doing? Maybe you ought to... Mental mind has to be strong. I had that same thing happen to me. She said, hey, wait your season. It, I left. No. I had to stay committed. There's going to be a lot of... You want to avoid all that. 
Stay preparing no matter what. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to the show. Please subscribe on our YouTube, Spotify, Apple, and wherever you listen to your podcast. I greatly appreciate it.